Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today's video I am going to be telling you guys what's been going on with my life. Um, for one thing, i just been like trying to do, you know, go to school, go to work because I just want to do those two things that are really important, you know, just to get, you know, money and learning experience, you know, talking to students, teachers, staff, whoever, and going to work, having more experience with other people, with other teams, you know, communicating, excuse me, and um, I did work last year, it was Camp Fire Kahito, and um, I worked there to like spring break to like February 1st to February 6th I think yeah and I got like money and I stopped going there because I had, I had school next the next day and it was pretty good I love working with kids you know working with kids just makes me feel like happy and you know makes me feel good you know being around, being around with them it makes me feel, feel happy because it's just like kids are just so special and they're so precious and I just love it and that's why I've been trying to like you know I want to go back there to see if I can get hired again which I'm still waiting for that email and that for that and for the call, you know, to call me back. I'm still doing all, you know, other um, applications to different jobs and then still doing more. I already did like 60 jobs and put all my resume in there and my emails, my phone number, everything. So, I've been, it's kind of been stressful because sometimes they don't really respond to my emails or call. Sometimes I'm always getting like random phone calls, like commercials, that it's not for me. It's just like random calls that everybody gets from every phone. So, it's kind of a bit like, you know, it's kind of a bit challenging and struggle and stressful. And it's just too much and and I want to go to school because I want to like take more classes um, just to learn because you know I just want to get that education so I could be like sm more smart like really really smart um, sometimes I get like angry or like upset like when I'm doing this kind of stuff, or like, you know, trying to figure out, like, when they're gonna call me for work. Like, I just want to be hired already, so I can save up money, and... Because... I just need to. To do something, instead of, like, you know, doing nothing, or being lazy. Which I'm not. Just half of the time. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. And um, and sometimes I have, to, I have to like you know my boyfriend is always like fighting over me, not doing nothing or you're not getting no job. Like what are you doing? And I start crying and start getting upset, getting angry. Like we always fight for like little things, and like I get that. Like I understand that. You know, he just he just graduated from college, so and right now he's trying to work out work on his business, you know, doing slaps and other things. But I'm not gonna say the person that I'm with, so but um yeah, it's just it's just been hard. Like I always tell myself, like, I hate my life, I hate my life, like, 
what are you doing? Like, I feel like I just don't want to be here in this world. That's how I feel. Because, you know, being an adult is pretty tough. It's like really, really hard. And I'm trying to learn from that. I'm trying to be more responsible. You know, like, I am not ready to, you know, grow up so fast. I don't want to be, I just don't want to grow up. I just want to stay like, like this because it's, it's really hard. And, um, adulthood, try, I'm just trying to, you know, learn from everybody you know, paying their taxes, their bills, their electricity, everything that needs to be paid. Like, nothing is for free. Like, nothing. Which I get that. You know, being 18, it sucks, but it's not. Because you had, you could have freedom, but at the same time, you had to do what you had to do. Just go to work, do something, do something that you like, or go to school that's pretty much it for that situation my other situation my other problem is that my body is the situation because I hate I hate being fat like I really do hate being fat and I hate I hate myself that I'm like you know eating too much food that's like junk and sometimes I get sometimes I get a little habit of doing that because when I'm eating I just you know get hungry and hungry and start eating more and eating more and um that's like the most hardest thing ever like I always cry over for this. Excuse me. My bad. I'm always crying over for this. By my weight. How, how much I weigh. Like, you're too big. Or, you're too ugly. Or, you're too fat. And, sometimes I always look, look at myself in the mirror. Saying like, wow. I need to get together. Like, I need to get my shit together. My body is not in shape. Um, like, see this? It's, don't you see this? My arm is jiggling. Because I'm eating too much. But, I don't know. I hate when people call me fat. And stuff like that. It's just, it really hurts my feelings. Because if someone calls me fat, then... <laughs> no, no, no. Don't mess around with me. Because you gonna mess the wrong person. And, um, it's just, I see those kind of girls, like, you know, they're so fit and they're so pretty. And they're so skinny. But, I don't want to be those kind of girls. I just want to be myself and I. Just me only. Like, sometimes, sometimes I don't care about my body. Sometimes I do. But the inside or the outside, you're, I'm still, well, if you guys are listening, you guys are still beautiful. And I'm still beautiful. Who, those girls out there, if you guys are like, you know, worried about your weight, just let yourself know that you should, don't care what people say about you or people judging you how you look or how you wear, as long as you're beautiful and you're happy, that's fine. But don't get hate from people saying that you're ugly or you're fat, you don't belong here, and stuff like that. Because that will definitely be worse. 
And sometimes I always tell myself, like, you're so beautiful. You're so pretty. Don't worry about your weight too much, you know? <coughs> don't, don't let people down. Don't let anyone put you down in that situation. Because I know everybody do care about me and how I feel. And yeah, so that's like the problem that I have is just losing weight. You know, I'm trying to be like, you know, thick. I want to be like, you know, fit and, you know, dress nice. So I don't have to be like, oh my God, she's ugly. Well, a lot of people would think like, oh my God, you're so pretty and everything. Like, you look so gorgeous. I love your makeup. I love your hair. Other things like that. Because I don't want to like, you know, I don't want to be down so much. I don't want to cry. I don't want to like, you know, feel bad for myself because the way how I look, the way how I dress, the way how I feel. Sometimes I really don't care if I'm like, you know, fat. But I do care about my health. That's like the, the most important thing about losing weight. It's just your health and you don't have no, what's it called? I don't have the name called. If you don't have no diabetes or other problems that you have in your body, you're good. Uh, the third one is um, my friends. Um, I haven't like seen my friends that often. Like I haven't talked to them. Or they haven't talked to me, you know? Because sometimes I feel like, I don't know, I feel like I'm so lonely. Like, I'm always left out alone. Like, I have, like, no one to talk to or stuff like that. And I know all my friends out there are just doing their own thing, you know? Work, can you know, going to school or taking care of their own families and everything like I get that I like understand that sometimes I always feel like they don't care about me like or at least check up on me and be like hey how are you how are you doing instead of me like doing them like saying it like oh hey like, I have to text them first instead of, like, they should text me, you know? But it's okay, you know? I'm always lonely either way. I mean, sometimes I do see my friends, sometimes I don't. I mean, like, sometimes they don't want to hang out with me or it, they just feel bad that, that I'm not doing anything or it's just... I don't know, stuff like that. Like, I feel like I don't have no friends. That's what I feel like. In my brain, I just feel like I have no friends to hang out or talk to. Someone that I can depend on or trust someone. Because I do need that as a friend. Someone that I care about. But they're gone. They're doing their own things, and I'm here, stuck in this life. It's just like, ugh. It's just... But I do miss all my friends, you know? Hanging out with my friends or, like, hanging out with my sisters. <sighs> like, I don't have friends. They're like a family to me, but sometimes it happens. People 
go and people don't come back <laughs> like I really do miss most of my friends I did hang out with one friend and we talked about everything I tell her that what's been going on with myself and other things which it was really fun we went we went to um we went to oh my god we went to seaport village i think it was east village but i don't know yeah i think it was and we just been talking walking around taking pictures it was fun because she had her free time to see me and I haven't seen her for a while because she's been, you know, going to school, going to work, and doing other things with her family. So, yeah. I still, I love all my friends. But sometimes in my brain, I feel like I don't have no friends. I feel like I'm left out. Like, sometimes I feel like people, they, they, they think they're all that, you know? They think they, they, they're pretty and cool and, like, you know, trying to be, like, <laughs> Miss Popular and, like, uh, I'm over here, like, no. And it's just, like, what should I do? Sometimes I try to fit in, even, like, back then, like, a long time ago, when I was, like, prior elementary school, and they, um, I was trying to, like, fit in with all the popular girls. Like, I was trying to fit in, you know, dress, you know, dress nice, dress, I mean, put like, a little bit of mascara. <coughs> Back then, my mom would never put, let me use makeup. But at least I would just put lipstick on, that's it. And I try to be so pretty for them, like, oh, can I join the club? Or, like... Can I be popular too and stuff like that and I'm always getting like uh oh, no you're too ugly you're so weird you don't belong here and I, I'm always everybody was bringing me down in like elementary school and I was trying to fit in you know I just want to be in like the cooler kids you know so that did not happen and that did not work out and then like people were just trying to say mean things about me and like basically bullying me and being their slaves back then it was like no that was way too much it was like no 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 like I constantly constantly like you can't tell me what to do <laughs> yeah so back then I always I I wanted to be like you know pretty and popular you know be like I'm the one, I'm the boss, you can't tell me what to do. But they were telling me, like, you know, back then, they were telling me, like, step, step by step how to be popular. First, you had to be, like, first, you had to dress nice. Second, you have to, like, you know, make new friends. I don't know. They were saying this, this stupid list that you had to, like, you know, be a part of popular and then like after that I didn't have no friends after no one didn't care about me everybody was saying st st dumb stuff like I don't know it was really dumb like st st stupid and I now, like, since I was in high school, I just feel like, wow, I have friends. I have, like, a bunch of friends that they do care about me and other things. Not just other girls that were elementary school, like, were so mean. Like, everybody has my back. And, um...
sorry, that was the house phone. I don't know who that was. Um, but yeah. I'm so sorry we missed you, but thank goodness for voicemails. We have some great specials going on right now for our window washing, gutter cleaning, and don't power washing that. services. We're gonna be but yeah, just, um. You can call us back at area code 619-370-9656. Again, we have some amazing specials going on right now. We're going to be in your area. Window washing, gutter cleaning, or power washing. Please call us back at 619-370-9656. Thank you so much. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, I'm, I've been kind of a little bit sick. And I've been coughing too much, so sorry about that i'm sorry about the phone i had to like stop talking but anyways i just you know no no matter what i hang out with my friends like they always tell me stuff and i always keep a secret and i would never tell nobody nobody because if I just tell somebody, they're going to be like, uh, they're going to make some r rumors and then make this drama and then they blame it on me. I'm the nicest person. Like, if you get to know me, I'm nice. If you think I'm like mean or like, oh, she's a little bitch. Oh, she thinks she's all that. Like, no. Like... I'm not the type of person. I'm like super kind, very nice, and friendly to everybody. If they be mean to me or saying st stuff about me, then yeah, I will definitely be rude to you guys. If you guys want to be my friend. If you want to. But other than that, I'm always nice to everybody that I hang out with or like, you know, make new friends. <laughs> And I always wanted to to be spoiled or be extra, you know? I always wanted to do that because most of my friends are a little bit extra and spoiled all the time. And sometimes I don't get that enough attention from everybody. Only from, like, from my quinta. Because from my quinta, I had my friends, my family, and... All attention came to me, but because I, I just love attention, I just love extra, I just love, like, you know, spoil. And sometimes I don't get that, I don't get enough attention from everybody because, you know, I don't know. And, um, you know, I want to get lots of things like, you know, buy a new phone, get a new car, if I have money, but, or like, buy new clothes, makeup, or perfume, anything that, that will make me feel more extra. I just love to be spoiled. Because sometimes I don't get what I want. Sometimes I don't ask, you know. And I want to have that attention towards me. You know, she's a star. She's pretty. Like, let's focus on her. Because sometimes I don't get attention from everybody. Because, I don't know. Because I'm not that, that wannabe girls, you know. Like, I'm always, like, left out of everything, like, you know. Like, this is exactly, like, this is why sometimes I feel like I don't have friends to talk to or, like, you know, hang out with or g go partying and have fun. I don't do that anymore, which I want to because that's what I want and I want attention from everybody, from me. I want everybody to give me attention, you know? Sometimes when it comes to parties, like, yeah, but when it's, like, when there's no parties or nothing, 
I don't get enough attention. I don't get spoiled. I don't get extra. But that's what I want. I don't know why. I feel like people do that often. But yeah. I think that's pretty much it for today's video. Um, I hope... I hope you guys like this video and subscribe to my channel and comment down below what should I do for my next video. Um, please don't give me hate comments because I don't really don't care about that. It, sometimes I don't mind that but you know what I mean. But yeah, I hope to see you the next video and